So hi everyone, today I wanted to share with you guys about Neutrogena Hydro Boost with Body Bomb. I was sent a complimentary sample for review and testing purposes on behalf of Home Tester Club and Neutrogena. So this is a new branding of an existing product that they have. And as you can see, it's very thick, but it's kind of airy in its um, texture. And it does have a slight tinge of blue to it. Um, once you apply it to the hand, it's fairly clear. So stay tuned. So hi everybody, as I mentioned today, I'm talking about Neutrogena Hydro Boost um, Whipped Body Bomb. So this is the little tube that it comes in. It seems to be a rebranding of an existing product that they already had. Um, I'm not sure what the real difference is between this one and the one that's sold in like a little jar, but I added the link to that one as well so you guys could see it. Um, basically what this claims to do is it claims to give you hydration and moisture for dry to extra dry skin um it has hyaluronic acid in it so it does plump your skin i'm trying to think of some nice ways to talk about this because it really didn't work for me um, but let me talk about the size in general it's a 0.7 ounce um little tube so it's decent uh, it does have like a bluish tinge to it i'm not sure how good my webcam will pick it up but it has like a kind of like a baby blue tinge. The webcam doesn't pick it up, but when you see it in natural light or even in the bottle, as you can see, it has like a baby blue tinge. It does have a scent to it. So for people that have sensitivities, it is scented. They don't have a fragrance free form. Um, what I found is that I tried it um, on damp skin and dry skin and I ended up with the same result. It really dried out my skin horribly. Again, um, I will admit that it was delivered on a very high heat day. It must have been at least 90 degrees to 100 plus degrees a day that it was delivered. So it had been sitting in the heat. It may have separated. That may have been why I'm having the issues that I'm having with it. I've been using it off and on, but what I found is, is that it left my hands feeling greasy. It left kind of like a film on my skin, like when I used it on my legs and I would go and itch my leg, I could feel like the cream coming off, which was a little gross. Um, and I tried it on the driest parts of my body, like my elbows and my feet, and it dried out my feet, something horrible. And that's that I was wearing like um, slippers or um, socks. It dried out my feet awful. Um, again, this just may be my experience with it. When I was reading the reviews after I posted my review for Home Tester Club, it seems to be a mixed bag. So some ladies are praising it. Some people are saying they had similar experiences to what I had. What I did find out is that it does have um, an alcohol in it. So it has, um, and it does have uh, like a, it does have glycerin as well. So I think maybe that's why it has that strange feel. For me, it felt almost kind of like a petroleum jelly sort of because it's, as you can see, it's fairly whipped. So when you actually work it into your hands, it melts. I'll show you on the back of my hand. It melts into the skin quickly. So it absorbs. So as you can see, my hand looks a little shiny. But it's just an interesting sensation since it has the um, the hyaluronic acid in it. It plumps your skin, but I noticed that it leaves sort of like a, like I said, a film on my skin. Um, this was not something I would purchase <laughs> um, for myself after the results that I had. Um, I would think that, again, results may vary from person to person. And since it was delivered, I'm thinking that the product separated due to heat because it was delivered on a very high heat day and I actually placed it in the refrigerator because the tube was so hot when it arrived it just it I didn't think it was good for it so I kind of let it cool off in the refrigerator before I used it so it may have separated again everybody's experience is going to be different but um, I've left the information for this product through Neutrogena and uh, the other one that I found that's sold in the jar on Amazon. So you guys can see what the difference is. Um, it retails for $7.99 US. Prices may vary depending on where you purchase it. 
but all I can say is thank you Home Tester Club and Neutrogena. This was an interesting product to try. Um, so if anybody else has tried it, let me know what you guys think about it. Um, have a good day.